Hello everyone, very warm welcome to Calendar with Kate Webster and Duncan Wood. It's Friday. Coming up tonight, the stars from Dancing on Ice. And a rock and roll guitarist. Many talented musicians on our programme before, but we've never met anyone who's released a CD at the age of just nine. We certainly haven't, but that's exactly what Amy Bannister, or should I say Amy J, from Chesterfield has done. And she joins us now with her dad, Brian, and guitar teacher, Ainsley. Well, firstly, to the star, Amy. I mean, very cool, a CD. How did this all come about? Well, I uh, was into a band called Wishbone and Ash, um, and two of my uncles played the guitar um, so I'd been living up with guitars so I thought I might record a CD um, and then one of my granddads died from cancer so I decided to do it for Cancer Research UK. So. Well, you've raised nearly £2,000, you've got the big cheque at the front there, that's yeah. fantastic. Now Dad, your daughter, nine years mm -hmm. old, into Wishbone Ash. Yeah. Get on down, man. What's yeah, yeah, absolutely. <laughs> what's been going on here? Well, she's in, into Wishbone Ash, but all sorts of other people. So it's anything that's rock and bluesy and, and always has it, actually, since three or four years old. And we've picked up on you when you were very young because we've got some pictures here oh. we can show everybody at home. Gonna Look at this. <laughs> you were grooving there when you were just three years old on the microphone. How to embarrass you. These pictures will come out when you are really famous, when you're on stage, like one of your guitar heroes, Brian May. This is what they're going to play when you're on all the big shows in a few years' time. <laughs> and Ainsley, how rare is it to find someone as enthusiastic and talented as Amy here? Very rare, it has to be said, and it's, it's a really nice thing to come across. I think the thing is that... Um, Talent is pr pretty uncommon, uh, enthusiasm is pretty uncommon, and so to get the combination of the two is just fantastic, it really well, is. Well, we actually cleared the studio for you a little earlier this afternoon. We got the amps in, so you could have a go, and we let you play. So let's just take a listen to how it went. That was fantastic. And that's just all improvised, isn't it? It's not just a song that you've copied or covered or anything, that's just improvised. Mm -hmm. You really love it, don't you? Yeah, I love it. It's brilliant. And what's your ambition for the future? You know, anyone you would like to be like, have a career like? I'd like to be like Brian May and be able to play guitar like him. Well, we've got a picture of you with Brian May, and as long as you don't end up with his hair, <laughs> don't do that with your hair, it'll be fine. We're like Brian, he's a very nice lad, but don't do that with your hair. And Amy, you haven't just got the one guitar, have you? Because your bedroom is full of a certain something. How many have you got? I've got six, but one of them I can't play because it's a bit broken, but it's it's a decoration. You haven't been doing the trashing of the room with the guitar and things when you say one's broken. You haven't got into those habits already of smacking the guitar on the side of the room, have you? No. I'm glad, I'm glad. Thank you so much for all coming in. Have a wonderful weekend. I'm just delighted to hear you play the music. And remember where you saw her first. It's Amy J. 